I'm tracking a mild evening tonight as temperatures are expected to stay in the 50s. Cloud cover starts to move back in tonight and that's going to keep us warm. Falling down to about 57 overnight. Winds will start to pick up even more for tomorrow. We have a wind advisor in place for our western counties through tomorrow evening. However, most of the area will see wind gusts anywhere from 35 to 40 miles per hour throughout much of the day with sustained winds up to around 20 or 25 miles per hour. So it's definitely going to be windy. That will help get our temperatures back up into the 70s for highs. It's definitely going to be a mild and muggy day as we'll see that next cold front move in from the west and that's going to bring us chances for some showers and a few thunderstorms by tomorrow night. Here's the breakdown with future track. It's going to be dry throughout the rest of this evening. A chance for a couple spotty showers during the day tomorrow, but we're looking at better chances as this front gets closer to us, likely after 11 o'clock or midnight on Wednesday evening. Better chances north of I-70 through Thursday morning, but the rain chances will shift south as that front pulls to the south of us. However, I'm expecting more energy to be floating along this front going into Friday. Areas south of I-70 will have a better shot at seeing more widespread rain on Friday into Friday night. Over the weekend, tracking some drier weather on Saturday. However, there's a chance for a few scattered showers. By late Saturday night to Sunday, I'll be tracking another area of low pressure. That's going to give us continued showers through much of the day on Sunday. And we'll have some cooler temperatures. Most of us are going to stay well above freezing. We'll be in the 40s, but just to the north of us tracking some wintry weather across parts of Iowa. Severe weather threat with this whole system is going to be somewhat low. However, there is a chance some of our northwestern counties could see a couple of strong storms into tomorrow night, likely after midnight. The main threat would likely be some small hail and potentially some gusty winds along with that heavy rain. Looking ahead to the weekend, that chance for rain will increase again on Sunday. Most of the area will see widespread rainfall with gusty winds and temperatures on both Saturday and Sunday stay in the upper 40s. Seven day forecast gets cooler by the end of the week, tracking a high near 53 on Friday with that rainfall for most of the area. After the weekend, that rain starts to clear up by Monday and we are left with highs in the 50s to start, start off next week.